here we have some of my favorite things to swallow. This one is a wire hanger. What we do with this is we swallow it just about right down to there. And then I'm gonna give you a little surprise. Okay. <laughs> If I was on Grinder, that'd be my profile pic. Hey. I'm 12 feet away. <laughs> How long did it take to learn? So a wire hanger, this is actually what I started with. Okay. And I was kind of obsessed, so it only took me 24 hours. Oh, wow, okay. <laughs> yeah, quick study. How do you even go about finding someone to teach you how to sort of swallow? So for me, it kind of happened backwards. I was taking a clown class, like you do, and... I, <laughs> like you do, like I, you do, you take a clown totally class. Totally normal. Okay. I found out that one of the other students that was taking the class with me was a sword swallower, and after I found that out, I just could not stop thinking about it. The sword swallower had always been my favorite part of the science show, and it was just like mind-blowing. You know, it's like you said, there isn't a place that you go where you can learn these things. Yeah. So it's just, it's unaccessible, and it doesn't feel like it's within your grasp. But once it was within my grasp, I couldn't not have this thing. So I just, I asked him if he would teach me, and he said yes. Okay, so now we have the sword. Yes, it is in the style of a crisp sword, which is why you get these waves. Okay. Yeah. And as you see, you have to like it before you stick it. Life lessons from the sideshow. Oh my gosh. Wow, that, I felt, so, I was so nervous pulling it out of your mouth, by the way. I was like, oh. Yep, you literally have my life in your hands. I know, I was like, now, is it possible for me to try this? I mean, good luck. <laughs> I'm gonna try it. <laughs> If I get this on my first try, are you gonna be jealous? Um, no, I will be proud. You will? Okay. Yeah. I'm nervous. Yeah, I, I remember the way I felt my very first time. Um, I touched this to the back of my throat and said, that's not happening. Is this is this wrong that I'm using your hanger? Uh, I mean. Is this not, not? It's been done before. Okay. I just you go just... up and just go for it? Okay. So, yeah, is there any you know, kind of notes you should give me? How familiar, how familiar are you with the anatomy of your throat? Not that familiar okay. with my, yeah. So you have your larynx okay. in front. That's where your voice box is. Yeah. And your pharynx. That's your esophagus. It goes to your esophagus and then to your stomach. Okay. You're going for the pharynx. You want to tilt your head back, make sure you are in perfect alignment. Okay. That's pretty good so okay. far. Okay. Uh huh. And then. The trick is just relaxing your reflexive muscles. Okay. I like to breathe out as I do it. Do you feel how that kind of opens your throat? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh huh. Okay. Yeah. Just, just, I yeah. can go for it? Yeah. Oh my God, I can't, why am I so nervous? <laughs> because it's, <laughs> it's a little crazy. Okay. Oh my God, it's so hard. Right? Yeah. It touches the back and you're like, no. <laughs> yeah, it's like, no, no go. Okay, come on, man up, man up, <laughs> be a man. Yes, that's what I tell myself every time too. Be a man, Crystal. <laughs> okay. Nope. Yep. It's not happening. <laughs> <coughs> My eyes are watering. Ah, yes. So, um, I have so much more respect. I'm crying. Oh my god. I don't know how. You... That was. I tap out. <laughs>